I think the human race is infected with a fucking virus. That's all. It has to be. I mean, people believing that the sun isn't real, that it's a simulator. I mean, when you think about that, really? It's a giant light bulb in the sky that lights the whole earth. And then, you know, people talk about flat earth, which, you know, I'll say it again. We've never been to the edge. The earth is flat. It's got to have four sides. Nobody's ever seen the edge. Nobody's fallen off. Nobody's taken a picture. And what the hell is underneath? And what's holding it up? I mean, come on, people, really. People are snorting condoms and eating Tide Pods. Is it any wonder that they believe this stuff? I, I ran across a video last night. Um, first time, it came on my front page. Thanks, Google. Um, Simon, I think his name was. He calmly sits there and comments on Flat Earth videos. And um, he was showing this one guy who believed that the rockets that go into space are nothing more than helium balloons. And it's getting worse. I'm sorry, I, I stayed away from this subject for a long time because a lot of creators that I follow and have much respect for believe in flat earth. And um, my opinion of all this has been, you know, to each his own. You believe what you want, it's the same thing with religion. But um, this is getting fucking nuttier than a bowl of grape nuts. I swear to God, I, I, you know, with the Mandela effect, that's bad enough. And people telling me that it's just bad memory. Um, no, it's not. There are things that are absolutely certain in my memory. Um, there, there could be a lot of things that I could swear is bad memory. I, I'm not denying that memory is infallible. You know, we forget things over the years. I'm human, everybody does. But then there are certain things that are locked down in our memory as absolute, especially when they're fresh, when the Mandela effect happens and it's a fresh memory as has happened to me in the last few months. So, anyway, um, I just had to comment on this because I... <laughs> I was in a good mood until I started going back and reading some of the comments on my comments and um, getting trolled. You know, I mean, it's one thing to leave a comment. It's another thing to be nasty about it. And that just pissed me off. You know, you know I just was like, nope, I have to say something about this now, okay? If what you believe is true... Let's just say that I'm from Missouri. Show me, okay? Show me. I want pictures. I want proof. I'm not going to take some Google answer for anything. I'm not going to take some gibberish about, let's do the math and, you know, we'll stand so many meters apart and see if there's a curvature. No, I'm not doing the math. Math has never been my strong subject. So, um, you know, you're going to fight with me over something that I can't defend myself on because math sucks. I hate math. Anyway, if you think that the sun simulator is real, I want to see a freaking picture of it. I want you to prove it beyond an absolute doubt. Don't take me to Google and show me a patent for a sun simulator because yeah, they have them. They use them in laboratories. That doesn't mean it's hanging up in the sky. And if you believe that the earth is flat, then show me a picture of the edge. Okay? I don't want to hear that um, Soros got billions of dollars and he's stopping us from going there. There's four edges. Okay? We have Australia, which is supposed to be down under. Or now it's New Zealand. That's actually further down because it's shifted. But, you know, if you're at the bottom of the earth and you're close to, you know the southern circle, um, the South Pole, rather, I should say, um, go out and take a picture of the flat edge, you know, let's find out what's underneath, 
If it's real, I want to know. But as far as I'm concerned, so long as we live in a society where people are eating soap and sorting condoms, I just have to say that we've all been infected with a virus. And hopefully we'll come out of this with our sanity. That's all I got to say. Anyway, I'm going to go dye my hair today. This stuff has been like this for too long. I wish I had this means of cutting the edges, though. I was in the store yesterday going, purple or red? They were out of purple, so it's red. Anyway, y'all try to have a good weekend. It's Labor Day weekend. Just another day in paradise for me. And um, I'm going to try to stay off the internet because it just makes me nuts. Have a good day, y'all.